For the past couple of weeks, there's my pumpkin. Heather Krings and her husband Jack take shifts staying at the hospital with their youngest daughter Delaney. Did you have a snack today? Cheesy poofs. Cheesy poofs. Less than two months ago, Delaney was diagnosed with an inoperable brain tumor. She is just four years old. I love you, baby girl. I love you. After the diagnosis and multiple surgeries, she was able to come home. Then an infection hit, and now she's back in the hospital. Delaney had an ear infection that wasn't going away. After another visit to her pediatrician and a CT scan, Heather and Jack received the news no parent wants to hear. Not something that's treatable by chemo or radiation or um, further surgery. So unfortunately, um, she will pass away. The tumor is in both sides of her brain, all the way down to the brain stem. It's a little bit more to the right side. So she actually has a side effect of basically like a stroke. Her left side is um, very, very affected. Leaving little Delaney with a crooked smile, but one that still brightens any room. I'm just knowing that I'm never going to have that light in my life again. It's just... Heather says the doctors are giving Delaney until Christmas. That means she's not able to go on her make-a-wish trip to Disney World. So the community has joined together to make her fifth birthday on December 16th a special one with a drive-by parade. Offers from local police and fire departments to have squad cars come in. Um, we've got some local community members decorating their vehicles, dressing up as like the Disney princesses. That's not the only thing the community has done. Jack's mother created a GoFundMe account to help with medical bills. It has generated thousands of dollars, along with birthday cards. A lot of local Pewaukee, Oconomowoc. Not only from Wisconsin, but from across the country. Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. Is that Fargo, North Dakota? It's not just the cards, it's also gifts. My car is completely packed with packages, which is honestly the most heartwarming thing anybody can do. Sharon Tomlinson is a friend of the family. She's been in charge of collecting the cards and gifts for Delaney. And I cannot tell you the endless amount of cards that we're receiving, packages, phone calls, texts, emails. This community from here around the world has band together to try to make a difference. From her favorite snack of cheesy poofs to dolls and toys from her favorite Disney movie Frozen. Love is all around Delaney. How do you tell a four-year-old that they're going to pass away in, you know, a month? How do you, how do you tell them? You can't. So she knows that a lot of people are sending her birthday cards because it's going to be one special birthday. What? I love you. <laughs> Delaney knows she has ouchies in her brain and that she's sick, but her contagious grin still keeps her parents on their toes. Her smile, her laugh. Her love, just her sweet personality and her witty comebacks and terrible knock-knock jokes. And while the next few weeks will be the hardest days for the Krings family, they'll continue loving and showing Delaney how big an impact her five incredible years on earth have made on them. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.